the one and only Naheem Hines of the Indianapolis Colts, a.k.a. my favorite weapon to use in Madden because you can't stop him in the slot. For you in this position at this point of your career, man, you know, another season on the horizon, new offseason, reconnecting with teammates, connecting with new teammates, such as quarterback Carson Wentz, how has that process been like so far? A blessing. Uh, the good, the bad, you take it however it comes, and no matter how it comes, just be ready. And that's really what it's like being in the NFL. Like, uh, my first two years, you know, I didn't take it for granted, but I also wasn't as appreciative as I should be. And this is, you know how it is. People come, people go. And just having the opportunity to play with Philip Rivers, one of my all-time favorites, watching him end his career, you know, and, and, and Carson, who I was, I was a big fan of, waking up every day and being with people you used to watch on TV, like T.Y. It's, uh, yeah, every day. And then you realize you're just people. It's uh, it's really a blessing. And honestly, like, even just playing on that field, being in that locker room, I really can't tell you. It's just, is it honestly surreal? It'll probably be surreal if I play in the league for 20 years. I bet you Tom Brady still can't believe it. I'm happy you said that, Naheem, because when it does come to those surreal moments or that welcome to the NFL moment that we all hear about, do you remember it coming in the form of a play or when you looked across the sidelines and you saw, golly, I used to watch Buddy growing up and now me and him about to battle for 60 minutes. Like When I first got to Indy, the first day I met Andrew, like, he walks up to me <laughs> and he says, you know, hey, Naheem, you know, had a great career at NC State and I followed you, you know, had a great career. I'm like, dang, like he kept up with me. That's cool. But I think my first real moment like that was with Adrian Peterson. The second, it was actually the, that's the second game of my career, first Love touchdown it. of my career. And I'm with Jordan Wilkins, another running back from my draft class. And he goes, hey, Naheem, if you said a couple of years back you'd be on a field with Adrian Peterson, what would you say? And I was like, heck no, it would never happen. But uh, saying that and scoring a touchdown, then talking to AP after the game and, you know, just um, him giving me some respect and telling me how to, you know, be a better player. It's going to be something I'm bragging my kids about. One thing that has been very evident about your career so far, man, is your versatility. You know, whether it's as running back, traditional role, in the slot, returning punts. How have you been able to maintain your comfort and your rhythm, especially in what is a loaded offense where there is a rotation? I'm a third out there every time I touch the ball. If I'm on the field once or a hundred times, I know that same threat is there. And really, I think it's just remaining competent in yourself, knowing your role. And like, it's not high school and college no more. You don't got to touch the ball a million times for us to win. I can touch the ball five, somebody else touch the ball 10, and that's how, what we do to win. But every time you're on that field, you have to make the most of that opportunity. And that's what I really pride myself on. One thing I want to touch on as well, which is harder to win, an NBA championship or a Super Bowl? A Super Bowl for sure. I agree. Uh, a, <laughs> I, just I mean, had to like ask. any person, any person, um, any person who argues that can literally just listen, listen to the term "every dog has his day." Mm -hmm. In basketball, you can have your day, and then you still got three more games to come back. In football, you have a bad day. That's mm -hmm. what happens. Sometimes in the Super Bowl, the best team doesn't even win. Might be just be mm -hmm. the best coach team, the team that executed the best that day, the team that didn't beat themselves. And that's what I'd really have to say to argue. Hey, I'm with you. <laughs> even <laughs> even even when I'm winning my chips with you and Madden, I agree. It is still hard winning Super Bowls compared to NBA title, even though that is hard too. You've been able to play with different quarterbacks. There's Phillip Rivers, there's Jacoby Brissett, there's a luck. How have you been able to adjust to each quarterback? You you first off is it's just a person. You have to understand them as a person. You get you have to observe them, see how they are. And they're really too as quarterbacks, listen to what they like. And just be transparent. Like, we're talking about certain routes. Hey, Carson, uh, on this one, I might speed up because I know at the top of the route I do this. And it really just builds on that trust and that communication. Then you got to go out there and ball. So just knowing who that is, knowing what he likes, and just talking to him, getting those extra routes, getting that extra time, and him hearing how I think and adjusting to my body language. We both get comfortable with each other. If I'm going to go across the middle, he's going to throw me, throw me open or expect me to be there. And that's really how you, that's how you do it with no matter who it is. It's just like your job. When you first go in there and you meet somebody new, you got to, you can't just go in there and give them everything. You got to go in there, fill them out, get to know them, get them to trust you. And then show them that you're here for the long haul. Teamwork makes the dream work. That is a fact. Hey, Naeem, seriously, man. Thank you once again for this <laughs> interview. Seriously, this is awesome, man. Thank you. Man, thank you. Thanks for having me on. Hope to be back. Absolutely. Hope to talk to you soon. Aaron Dolan here. Thanks for watching and make sure you click below on that subscribe button for more great FanDuel content and check out some of our latest uploads and playlists right over here.